here we are in week five, and we have two things to do. Uh, I have noted here on the calendar, but first I want to show you something really cool. I got Costco Connection in the mail last week, and I noticed on the front cover was Sir Ken Robinson, and it had a nice article about his, his ideas. Furthermore, I was flipping through it, and there was an article on backing up your computer. Really cool, one-page deal. And then there was one on Donors Choose. I thought, oh my gosh, this is just too, too cool. We were talking about this in class, and it really related to us. And I thought, you know, finding really good resources is really cool. So I was hoping you would appreciate that. So the links here will take you to that material. The other thing I saw is uh, I get a weekly, or you know, not necessarily every week, uh, Kariki sends me a newsletter, and they have all kinds of cool stuff. It's all free, open source material. But I thought, you know, when we think about our professional learning environment or network, our PLN, you know, who's in that? I have certain, you know, subscriptions that come to me in my email that really influence me, and Kariki is one of them. So I just wanted to share that. So specifically for our schedule this week, one, I was off on the dates. I thought TCI 517 ran throughout the rest of the summer, but I know some of you probably knew this, but, you know, I didn't realize the deadline was actually last week. So the course is actually over. <laughs> but um, with the good graces of CityU, I have an extension. So what I did, two things. One, this week I modified it, and I condensed the other two weeks that we had coming up after this into just this week. But it was easier to do than one might think because we cut off a whole presentation we are going to do. We talked about that last time we were together. We're not doing that for 517 because you already did it for ECU 514. Um, in fact, let me highlight that first. Um, you're going to be doing an elevator pitch for that technology piece that you did for ECU 514. And so that's the, one of the things you'll do for this week. And that elevator pitch, just again, 100 to 150 words. This is a short synopsis of what the technology is that you did for your presentation that you were going to talk to your administrator or tech person in your district for. So again, this is the bite-sized, quick, uh, crazy, sexy, cool you know, phrasing statement that you would do. And just post it to your TCI 517 student page. Um, title that uh, your elevator pitch. Then the other thing is to look at the Windows basic file. I have it linked here. It is linked at the bottom of the resources page for 517, but you can click here and it'll take you to that file and go over you know, the basic skills for Windows. And again, I just kind of highlight some of the things that you can or cannot do. And for, we, I think, our one Mac person, um, if you have Windows, you, know, you can do that Windows piece. If you want to do it for Mac and kind of do a comparison, um, trying to find some of the things that they have listed there, go for it. I'm very flexible about it. So uh, when you're done, do a reflection, post it onto your Google student page, and name that uh, basic Windows or Mac file skills, you know, whichever one applies to you. So we have two journal entries for this week. Also, you do not need to copy and paste any reflections to Blackboard. Blackboard is shut down because the TCI 517 course is officially over, so you know, they closed down all the goodies, so we don't have access to that anymore. If by chance for a previous entry where you were supposed to copy and paste it into Blackboard and you didn't get a chance to do that, um, there's nothing we can do about it now. Just make sure that you have it on your Google page. As long as you have the entry there, I'll be able to see it and so on. And um, yeah, so I just wanted to clarify that. So the deadline for this week's material is the end of the week. Um, we could say through the weekend would be fine. And um, if you have any questions about that, please let me know. And lastly, I want to go up to the top here and click on 514 and just highlight that even though this is a 517 video, and both classes are kind of running together. 514, I wanted you to have, we had talked about this last class, having all your material wrapped up by August 11th. I had on the schedule previously the 20th, uh, but again, this course closes down sooner than I thought, but the 11th should be fine to have all your work posted. And I have not made any changes to 514. It's all the same stuff that we talked about in class. Um, nothing new here. So this, all this detail should apply. And if you're having issues with this stuff, just please contact me and let me know. I know a couple of people have already contacted me about getting a hold of people and timelines and so on and so forth. Uh, I'm flexible. I understand the situation, especially during summer. So please keep me in the loop. All right. That's our overview for 517. 
And if you have any questions, please let me know and hope your summer's going well.